You have such pretty hair. It gets lots of tangles. You better keep her mouth shut if she knows what's good for her. Alright. Let's have a look around. Talk hey to the girl. folk. See. Can you just drove? We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? Guess this is get to meet your neighbors, Tim. Back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Wanna bet? No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. That's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die. They want the car getting arrested? Let go. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how is that? It's easy. Well, yeah. It's easy. So, you're good? <laughs> anyway, Mr. Smarty it's Pants. almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Peaceful for now. Oh. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? Kenny, how's your mustache? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean, in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I think I've got it handled okay. As long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe, sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. Yosh, I'm a for a flavor. Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. The government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, Everybody whatever's biting and paying. Kachi wouldn't be wild boat. about it, but the boat's not that bad. How's your son doing? I'm on a boat. Good, I think. kachi has got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and Christ, just lucky I was there. <laughs> Looking for we a glory hole. Bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. <laughs> you showed an interest in this family. Reliable didn't really want that. World, but it gets the job done. Oh yeah. This is around. Little tiny house. How you doing, Duck? Good. Is there a dumb I'm shit? gonna drive the tractor. Good. I'm the foreman. Yeah, Lift you with are. Your back, Sean. Foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Hey, Lee. Kid doesn't get out much. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. If 
So I have to use the analogs of this. Oh. My dad doesn't know how That's bad it is. He, he can't open a set of handcuffs, yet he can saw wood perfectly on his own. A, kid. a boy. Just shot him right in the face. Damn. Oh shit, damn. Damn. He didn't even hesitate. Damn. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. I don't think I'll tell them a bash the babysitter's head in my hand. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, you see my dad around. He might want some help in the barn. Do you uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. That's the word. That is the world's worst fence. There's a door in the fence. <laughs> she got the noise. Ugh. He called out a fence. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure yeah. I follow. He's on to me. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I was on my way out anyway. Uh, timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh, if there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. Uh, this farm's a <laughs> nice plot of land. Huh, had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? What is it? I don't know who you are or what you did, but you better become a better liar and fast. Let's say things don't get He's better the back me. in the city. Kill him. Or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. Oh, and I'd start checking the attitude, friend. Check your own attitude. Go! I'll get my gun! Jack, Jack was nice in the 80s, man. Alright. Oh, could you only choose to save one? There we go, Freddie Mercury's got the young lad. 
Come on, Kenny. Kenny! You coward. That won't work. Uh-oh. He's dead. <laughs> James May just got his head blown off. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. I can fix you. Don't worry. We'll stitch you up. <laughs> it almost, it almost got me, man. It, he tried to save me. Yeah, almost. I know, son. Oh, this is awkward. Oh, nice of you to go back, Kenny. Get out. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Yeah, Kenny, sorry. get out of here. Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. <laughs> I wasn't strong enough. I'm mm -hmm. sorry. If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger, or your friends aren't cowards. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. You better be just talking to Kenny. She's looking at me. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Multi man kicked out as well. Why did I get kicked? I tried to save his young Why did I get kicked out of this? God oh, damn it. Great, so now I have to travel with a guy whose son I refuse to save. That's nice. This won't be awkward at all. This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Look! Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. That's not a good idea. <laughs> good idea. What do you think was gonna happen? Amazing how people walk around with padlocks in their pockets, isn't it? And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? Whoa, chill the fuck out, lady. We're just people trying to avoid those things, <laughs> just like you. Don't come in here and swear at me. I'll say whatever I want if you start threatening these people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? I I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those kids outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God. 
damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a <laughs> bitch about it. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. This lad. Says his nose. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body. Wasn't bitten, was he? One hole. No. I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? <laughs> Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. We kick his Good ass. Show. That's what I'm thinking. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Yeah. Nobody's doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy. <laughs> never been here before. Looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Then we deal with it then. But right now, we're just freaking everybody out. Uh, and you're ready to deal off. with it because that boy is bitten. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. Knock this guy out. Happily. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh man. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> sake, Kenny. Jesus. No water inside. Get up, Lee. I see the problem here. There's a hole in your head. You okay? Just great, thanks. Just great, thanks. Uh, guys. Uh, Everybody down. Stay quiet. I say send him out there. He'll be on the for days. Sounds like a photo here. That was stupid. That was. Uh oh. I don't think he's gonna turn. Was he the one bitten? No. Don't be crazy. It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes. We're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Oh, now they're all nice to me, look. What are we looking for? We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. Where's I'll the keep officer's going to go fuck himself. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agree. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm 
quick. He is insane. And he'll make it. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. What's your name? Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you <laughs> your medicine. And Larry. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. And I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Oh, they don't like that.